everyone, how are you doing? I hope you're having a great day. I am so excited because I have the box by Fashion Stud to open today. This is my second one ever and I really enjoyed the first. Uh, recently they opened up their wait list and I heard a lot of you were able to get on which is great. So this box is pretty new and there are limited uh, quantities so uh, not everyone can get this. There is currently a wait list so I will leave that down below if you guys are interested in signing up. But what the box is, it's a beauty subscription and it costs only $19.99 uh, per month and it has free shipping. I don't even think there's any taxes. Like it's pretty affordable and you get at least $80 worth of stuff. I think last month I received over $150 of product and it was really good. If you guys missed that video, I'll link it down below. But seriously, the box is like making a run like with the beauty boxes. Like it's really awesome and $19.99 is a great price so I'm hoping um, now that they're gaining popularity and everything like that they'll start to make more so everyone can get it but if you were able to get it this month let me know um, and if not I hope you can get it next month they usually um, let you know on their Instagram page when uh, the waitlist will open so check your email follow them on Instagram all of that um, anyways, let's get started, but before we do, I just want to remind you all that I do have two giveaways going on. They're both beauty giveaways. One is in my Ipsy Plus video and one is in my Boxy Lux video. So if you're interested in entering those, I believe they both end the 20th, so definitely check them out. They're linked below. And let's get started and see what is in here. So when I open up the box, this is what I see. It says, warning, <laughs> the contents of this box may cause extreme excitement. You have scored $80 to $150 worth of products you'll enjoy and love. I want to personally welcome you to the Box by Fashion Stud Glam Fam, a consciously curated collection of classic brands and the unveiling of new and emerging brands boxed and delivered to your door each month. Awesome. And there's some paper, let's see, um, box with a purpose. It says, with every box purchase, you're helping 1736 Family Crisis Center by assisting those in need in the form of monthly makeup, beauty, and self-care goodies with the intention to enhance self-confidence and self-image. 1736 Family Crisis Center is a nonprofit organization based in Los Angeles with the mission to help people through crisis, including domestic violence and human trafficking. We're happy to announce this partnership and support a cause you love as well as offering amazing products you love to use. That is amazing. I love, love, love when my boxes give back. So that makes me feel even better about my purchase. So this is the card I was reading from. And then under that was the monthly card that has all of the items in here along with pricing. And it says in the bottom, the total retail value is $149. So I paid $19.99, I'm getting $149 of value. So let's see if I'll actually get some use out of these products. Uh, and on the back, it looks like there's just like some advertising about some of the brands we're getting in here. And then everything else is in here. All the products are underneath this tissue paper. So let's get this open. And let's see. the first thing I see, it looks dirty, but just from like the little swigglies. This is by Teamy. This is the detox mask, the green tea blend. This is made with matcha, lemongrass, and clay. So I've talked about Teamy before on my channel. I talked about um, their green tea facial scrub, uh, and I really enjoyed that. I spoke positively of it. So I'm excited to try this out. Um, I've seen this like all over Instagram. I feel like people rave about this mask. So I guess now I can finally see if it like is worth the hype. So that's exciting. So this is what it looks like. It's um, pretty much the same packaging as my facial scrub. I have that actually in my shower right now. Um, so I use that once in a while. And this says not tested on animal, made in the USA. I think it's actually made in Florida, which is cool. 75% organic. So I'm excited to try this out. Let's learn a little bit more about it. Uh, this green tea detox mask is $30. Wow. This mineral rich green detox mask is a must have in your self care routine. Made with organic green tea, lemongrass, and bentonite clay, this mask is formulated to rid pores of impurities while replenishing the skin with necessary superfood ingredients perfect for all skin types. I honestly generally like use sheet masks, but I'm excited to try this out. And I could use some like skin detox. I've had weird breakouts the past few days. Like I have one like up here like under my eyebrow. I'm not sure if you can see on camera. I hope not. But like in weird spots, like under my chin, like where I normally do break out my chin, like I get hormonal acne and stuff like that. But I have to figure out what's causing that. So I could definitely use some detox. So I'm excited to try that. If you guys have tried it, let me know your thoughts. Because I know a lot of people have, or at least it seems so on social media. Let's see what else we have in here. 
Oh, this is by Melanie Mills Hollywood, the Glean Body Radiance in Disco Gold. So I think this is like a body highlighter. Let's see how it says. It says, for maximum transfer resistant, use a clean, dry skin in place of other moisturizers. If applying to the face, use with or under foundation. Interesting. Um, this is $18 to get 30 mLs or one fluid ounce. It says, Gleam Face and Body Radiance is a revolutionary all-in-one makeup, moisturizer, and glow you can use for face and body. This long-lasting formula is perfect as a body glow, body shimmer, body bronzer, or body highlighter all in one. I never use products like this, but I'm open to trying it. I got a little bit of sun yesterday. I'm looking at the viewfinder. I don't think you could tell, but I went out on a boat, um, so maybe I could use this. Let's see if Disco Gold um, matches my skin tone, or I mean, is compatible. Like Sometimes I'm worried these things will be too dark on me. There's a safety seal, so let me get that off. I saw someone raving about this. I think it was like the not so evil stepmother. She loves this stuff. Um, so it's like looks kind of yellowish there. Let me rub it in my skin. I'm just trying to see if there's a scent. I don't, it just smells kind of smells like Play-Doh, but I don't think that means it's like expired or anything. But that is it on my hand. Can you guys tell? It's very like yellow and glittery. But yeah, I'll have to try that out. Maybe if I keep getting a little bit more sun, which I plan to, I want to spend more time outdoors and I just love going out in the boat. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know how much use I'll get out of this. Uh, it's kind of small. I think this is a smaller size. I think it comes in a bigger size as well. Uh, but I don't see myself using this like every single day, so I'll have to try it out. I think you can use this on your face under makeup too. It's very glittery. So yeah, if you guys have like like ways you use this, let me know. Um, or if you've tried it, your thoughts. Do you think this this could work on my complexion? I, I'm really curious if you guys can see it. I think I can see it in the viewfinder, that like highlight shade. Yeah, it looks really pretty actually. Next up is by the Perfect V, the VV Serum, Beauty Serum for the V. It says rejuvenate, revitalize, and firm. And I know a lot of people like weren't pumped about this, but I kind of am. Um, I have something by this brand already. It's like I got it in a past Sunday Riley box. I think it was the very first one I got. Like it was like in February. And it's like an exfoliator. So I use that in the shower before I shave and it, it's really effective. It's like a gentle exfoliator for that, that region. Um, so let's see what this says. A new luxury skincare line to beautify the V. The V, the small triangle, we wax, shave, laser, sugar, trim, sugar, trim, dye, even, and then leave until the next time. Multitasking beauty cream, serums, mists, and sheets that pamper the delicate skin of your V. Um, so they have a bunch of stuff in your line, and I think it's important to take care of your skin everywhere in your body. I think a lot of people neglect their like, skin in general. They focus more on their face. I try and moisturize everywhere. So it makes sense to like use products down there. I'm like excited to try it out and see if it works. I don't know how this would work for people that don't do anything, any upkeep down there. I'm trying to say this in a way that like won't get me demonetized or in trouble, <laughs> um, you know? But I think if you do upkeep down there, like shave or wax or anything like that, I think this will be probably really useful. Like your skin could use some TLC down there, I think. And this is the packaging. And if you're like one of those people that you, you want to be more discreet, this is definitely discreet. It doesn't like say the full word in there. Wow, this is $54. It says the 2018 Pure Beauty Awards bronze winner is a must have for your daily routine. So it won awards, cool. Uh, dedicated to the bikini area, this beauty serum rejuvenates, revitalizes, and firms the skin to leave it soft to the touch. Elderflower extract and bilberry helps brighten the skin while sea buckthorn soothes and vitamin E conditions. For best results, lightly dry the V, the bikini line, and visible skin of the triangle area, and apply a small drop of VB serum. So I'll definitely start using this. <laughs> this will be part of my skincare routine post shower, I'm assuming. But yeah, I, I don't know why people, I think some people, I don't know, I think we need to make the conversation more normal to talk about that stuff. But that's all I'll say for now. I'm, I'll try it. Next up is a jumbo eyeliner, liquid eyeliner by Kaylin. Oh my, I'm so upset. I somehow the like cap popped off my um, Hank and Henry li uh, liquid liner that I was falling in love with, and it like dried up. Um, so I could use another eyeliner now that I'm starting to use eyeliners. I have some on today. I don't know if you could tell, but I like using eyeliners now. I'm not gonna open it up and swatch it right now just because I have one open, a different one. I don't want 
to um, ruin this. I opened up like a drugstore one I had, or it was already swatched. I don't remember what it was at, off the top of my head. I think it's one, yeah, that was already open. I need to use it because it's not cruelty free. It's like a Maybelline one. But anyways, um, this Kaylin Jumbo Liquid Eyeliner is $18. It says, achieve effortless control and dramatic definition with this ultra rich jumbo felt tip liquid eyeliner. The large tapered tip of the Kaylin Eye Jumbo Liquid Line Eyeliner ensures bold, dramatic detailing. This easy glide, smudge free liquid eyeliner adheres quickly to the skin for waterproof wear. Cool. I'll get to that eventually, probably. Next up, looks like we have like an eye mask. Oh, cool. Yeah, I use eye masks. I used one the other day. I've mentioned this many times, but I even if I sleep eight hours like I did last night, I still get eye bags. I haven't found a Miracle Eye Cream yet that helps. So, but sometimes I find that eye masks do help a little bit. Like on days my eyes are extra puffy, like the days I don't get eight hours of sleep. But anyways, this is the I woke up like this gold foil eye mask by SF, I think it's a brand. It says Soothe, Nourish, Brighten, and Tighten. So let's learn more about this. So um, Skin Form, so SF stands for Skin Form. This is $4. Based in New York and made in Korea, SF pride themselves in embodying the best in both innovation and trendiness. All of their products are created to be fun and super easy, completely clean, 100% cruelty-free, and vegan. All right, I'm excited to try this out. Nice. I think we have just one more item. Let's see. Yep, and this is an eyeshadow palette. This is by the Beauty Crop. I'm actually wearing um, a bronzer by the Beauty Crop today. I'm, I really like that brand. I never hear about them though. And it says this is the um, Dawn. Oh, Dawn Gazing Palette. It's like look at this packaging. It's fun. I couldn't read it at first. Uh, so it says, inspired by the kaleidoscope of pinks and magentas of the sky at dawn, our dawn gazing eyeshadow palette features 12 buttery and highly pigmented shades in three different finishes. Velvety matte, creamy metallic, and long wearing glitter. This richly toned palette features 12 pink and purple shades that can be layered in infinite ways to create a vast array of looks with just one palette. Layer different textures to create unique combinations or be bold and finish off the look with a glitter topper to create out of this world eye looks. Uniquely formulated with jojoba and coconut oil and is talc free. There's no parabens, um, with, it's cruelty free, no mineral oils, no phthalates, vegan. Awesome, so let's get this open. I just realized I shouldn't have done my makeup before filming. I should have used this on camera, but I'll use it in an upcoming get ready with me. I wanna do those more often, like I've said. So this palette is $25. Okay, look at my fingers right now. The, stuff, the packaging in here is like getting all over me, icky. I'm just gonna rip this box open. <laughs> it's easier for me. So there's some bubble wrap, which is nice to keep it safe. Uh, cool, so that it has the same type of packaging as the outer packaging, which I like. I think this is so fun. <laughs> Let's look at it. Ooh, so there's no mirror, but that's okay. I, like, I use that mirror behind me. Oh my god, look at it, it's so fun. There is a sheet over it to protect it. All the shades are perfect. Oh my God, this is really pretty. So it looks like there is one pressed glitter in there. I don't use those, but the rest, like these are shades I will wear like every day. Here, let me get that cover off so you guys, it's not as reflective. But because of the packaging of this, it probably is gonna be reflective, so. Pretty. I'm excited to use this. Hopefully um, you guys can see the colors okay. Cause I know with that like fun packaging, I'm such a child, I can't stop. I'm excited to use this. Like, I think I'll use all the shades besides Pandora, that press glitter looking shade. But this is like, for people like me that like, like what some would say, boring eye looks. I love like the pink eye looks. I try and do bold things, but I just feel so much more comfortable with more like, you know, pink and nude shades. So I'm excited to try this. Let's see, is there any more information on it? Nope, it pretty much says, um, what I read in the back, it features 12 buttery and highly pigmented shades and three different finishes, velvety matte, creamy metallic, and long wearing glitter. So I'm glad there's just one glitter in there. And I think $25 is a decent price for an eyeshadow palette. So I am pumped to use this super fun palette. So overall, I think this is a pretty good box. I think I may have liked last month better, but let's do a recap. So I'm definitely pumped about this palette. I can't wait to use it. I honestly don't know if I will use this body glitter thing. Um, Cause it's like all over my fingers right now. It seems like it will be long lasting. Um, I would put it on now, but I'm going out for coffee and like, you know, I don't want to show up to Starbucks like, you know, it's like <laughs> the morning. Um, 
but I'll try that out soon on my body. Maybe I'll just like wear it in a video and see if you guys notice. <laughs> but um, the mask, I've heard so many people rave about it. Um, mostly people I don't know like on social media. So I'm excited to try this out finally. I always like getting eye masks. I think it would have been better to like get a pack of them, but it's okay to get one just to try it out. Um, and unlike everyone else I've heard from, like my friends here on YouTube, <laughs> I'm excited about this V serum. I don't know, something different. I love getting things that are different and unique in subscription boxes. Cause like, honestly, we how many like black eyeliners have we received over the course of beauty boxes? You know, like so many, like it's something like a lot of people use daily. So that's nice, but I like getting things that are like unique and new. Um, and this is definitely unique. So yeah, so that is everything. You guys have to let me know your thoughts. Did you guys get it? Um, all that, would you guys use the serum? Um, anyways, thank you guys so much for being here in unboxing with me. I love you so much and I will see you in my next video. Bye.